Good morning, this is LaQueen Battle about a first aid responder services here in the Boston area. Um, arguments begin in October, mid-October of this year uh, against for the United States Supreme Court uh, versus um, uh, the Students of Fair Action versus Harvard, Harvard University and University of North Carolina. I'm sorry, it's not Harvard versus Uni University of North Carolina, it's Harvard University uh, Harvard University and University of North Carolina versus students students for fair admissions. They are arguing against using race as a factor in college admissions, which is pretty much the fundamental right of affirmative action and Title VI, pretty much establishing a precedent of taking away, uh, leading to um, determining whether affirmative action is really necessary in U.S. college admissions. It is ridiculous that it has come this far. Unfortunately, a lot of people have opinions about um, those who are not granted uh, this same equal access and treatment in United States colleges and universities. So if you want to be proactive, I've been yelling it here out in the public and I'll be making some more speech, be doing some speeches here to my friends and everybody here in the Boston area and being, you know, I'm always politically active, I'm always involved. Um, the Supreme Court arguments begin in mid-October, uh, late September, mid-October. If you, your family, or your loved ones would like to go to Washington, D.C., okay, to Washington, D.C., to support this case, you are more than welcome to come to Washington, D.C. I do not know if there will be any events in regards to this very important, important case, but you are more than welcome to come to, yet to Washington, D.C., our nation's capital, to support such a fundamental right, um, as well as, of course, um, I'm not sure if there's going to be any audio or video regarding this very important case, but you are more than welcome to share and talk about this case with your your family and your loved ones and, and friends. I guess this is the president saying the precedent leading to whether affirmative, affirmative action and race, affirmative action and race should be used as a factor in U.S. college admissions. Okay, so it's very it's it's crazy that people would actually think that race is not as uh, that. You can't go to school based on your low income socioeconomic status for those of those for those people who do not have the same opportunities as other people. It is ridiculous, but unfortunately, that is just how it is. Okay, so this is Laqueen Battle about a first aid responder services here in the Boston area. Um, in the suburbs, I'm very happy to be here and continue to service my community. Um, some people may think, oh, I'm just a blog. Oh, I'm just a blogger. I am a blogger, but I'm also first a responder. I'm a medical assistant. I'm a teacher. I'm a community advocate. Uh, I do a lot of things. I just love to be of need. You can also reach me on my books on Amazon and Barnes and Nobles. My latest book is called, uh, you can just find more of my books there. You can reach me on all social media platforms, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, and YouTube. I love you guys. Please continue to keep me in your thoughts and prayers. Again, arguments begin this October leading to the United States Supreme Court decision on whether um, about affirmative action in U.S. schools, whether race should be used as a factor in admission to, you, to schools. Okay. All right. God bless you and your family and have a great day.